I got on Bushwhacker in the first round of the finals last year, and uh, now I've got to get on Asteroid, getting on two of the rankest bulls in the world, and I, I guarantee you they are two of the rankest bulls in the world. And uh, but I mean, just even having the opportunity to get on them, it's uh, it's, it's great. Did y'all have any plan different than the first time you rode him? Yeah, I was going to ride him this time. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Uh, you can think about it all you want, but uh, once they open that chute, off planning kind of turns to reaction. Uh, you can't plan anything when you're getting on these bulls. I know, but you've seen what happened before, so I mean, yeah. maybe. Yeah, but. I don't know if you get on there and. Uh, I guess uh, YouTube bushwhacker. There's not really a video that you want to watch to uh, watch to study. They're all they're all pretty scary. But I think I think you know today I'd I'd uh, you know kind of look through there and all the riders that I know that got on him and pretty much go through you know what he what he felt like step for step. And uh, you know none of those guys had rode him, but they could all tell me you know where they thought they went wrong and. Uh, you know what you'd have to do to correct that, which uh, you know, kind of like Art was saying, all that stuff I prepared for all day. Uh, you know, he uh, he had he had his own game plan. Ellen? Yeah. So, Cord, what did what was it? Forty eight and a half points feel like? Uh, th that's the thing about it. You know, some of those bulls you uh, you definitely want to get on uh, to try out yourself and. And I, I think that bull, he, he's definitely all he's cracked up to be. You know, whether they, whatever they marked him, uh, that bull is definitely a, a, a star. And uh, and after getting on him myself tonight, I I, I just gotta agree with him. He is uh, he's an awesome awesome bull.